Eleven Labs just got dethroned as the king of AI voices. Cartesia's brand new Sonic 3 voice delivers lightning fast 40 millisecond response times, three times faster than Eleven Labs flagship model, all while sounding more realistic. <laughs> uh huh. Sometimes you just have to pause and like appreciate how far you've come. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to use this new voice in retail. Compare both Cartesia and Eleven Labs top models. I'll happily hold some snickerdoodle cookies for you. How many would you like me to set aside and when do you plan to come by to pick them up? I've reserved a dozen snickerdoodle cookies for you to pick up in about 30 minutes. And at the very end, explain why this is a complete game changer for voice AI. Now you might be wondering why this is such a big deal. And yes, I'm a nerd, but these text-to-speech models can make or break a voice agent. They're incredibly important and basically control how the entire conversation feels and sounds for a user. The only other thing that is equally as important is actual model and prompt that decide what it says, but this literally decides how the entire voice agent sounds and responds and how quickly it does it, which as you can probably infer is massively important. If you're new here, my name's Tommy Christ. I've automated over 400,000 real calls with my agency, Arose AI, and I share everything I learned by actually implementing AI agents inside of real businesses. So let's hop into it. And so here we are on Cartesia's website, and you can see they just dropped Sonic 3 within 24 hours of me recording this. And it's an ultra fast text-to-speech model meant for conversational AI using stuff like AI agents, voice agents, AI receptionists, etc. And so some of the main features and sort of, you know, cool things it has, they really highlight on here. And that's some of this, what they call breakthrough naturalness, which is it laughing. So let me play that right here. I'm dying over here. <laughs> I just can't. And then it sounding excited. I can't believe it actually worked. <laughs> After all that waiting, it finally happened. And then here's it sad. It's strange how something can feel so permanent, and then one day, it's just not. It's speaking in 42 different languages. Are bhai, tension mat le. <laughs> Picture abhi baki hai mere dost. Uh-huh. Sometimes you just have to pause and, like, appreciate how far you've come. And so, obviously, that sounds really good. But that is, at the end of the day, just a demo on their website. So that's, you know, the best it'll sound. They're going to show off the best. So I'll show you again at the end of this video. I'll do a full side-by-side -side comparison between Eleven Labs and Cartesia. Now, another really cool thing that is very important for voice agents is what they just call this, like, context-savvy accuracy, where it can get stuff like numbers sounding correct and when to actually use them and acronyms. And, you know, stuff like this where it reads NASA, but says FBI uh, using each of the letters. And so let's listen to some of this. Put in 12506 Union Square, San Francisco, California, 94108. Call up NASA, the FBI, and the NSA. Then um, try UNESCO. Should I read again what I read yesterday? And so that's something, again, voice agents struggle with massively, especially stuff like addresses, anything to do with digits and for sure any acronyms these things would historically you know read out every letter or every number it just would not sound very natural not how a human would speak and once again you see that 40 millisecond uh, response time there is just super super fast and then you know available in a bunch of different languages now hopping into retail this is what a voice agent looks like if you want a full tutorial I have those on my channel. So I'm sort of assuming, you know, you have an account, everything like that. Super, super easy to actually connect to Sonic 3. So your voice is controlled up here. And what you do is you come over here to select a voice. You'd select this tab and decide to choose Cartesia. And then you'd select a voice. They have some recommended voices here. They actually have the same exact voices, like preset voices as Eleven Labs does, or a lot of the same ones. And so I'm going to choose Simo. So I'm going to click use voice. Now we are using Cartesia now. However, it's set on their Sonic 2 model. So to use Sonic 3, you come over here and click this. Now, one thing I do want to know, I'm actually going to go back to 11 Labs. Look at this latency here. 
So this is 670 to 850 milliseconds. So that's 0.67 to 0.85 seconds. A thousand milliseconds is one second. And so if you come back to 11 labs and choose CMO, you'll see that jumps up to basically the, the top end of Cartesia's is now the baseline for 11 labs up to a full second of latency. And you know this was serviceable, but you obviously want it to be as responsive and human-like as possible. And so you can already see how much quicker this model is. And not just that, but it sounds fantastic. And so first, I'm actually gonna go back to the 11 Labs voice. We'll get a baseline to sort of how that sounds. And then I'll switch back over to Cartesia and I'll let you guys be the judge. I will do both a web call on here. All right, so switching back to 11 Labs, I'm gonna choose CMO and thankfully they actually have CMO for both. So the voice actually doesn't change, just the model. And let's listen to this. Hi, thanks for calling Tommy's Cookies. This is Emily, how can I help you today? Hi, Emily. I was wondering what sorts of cookies you have if I were to come in right now. Hi there. I'd be happy to share what we have today. We always have our classic favorites like chocolate chips, snickerdoodle, and peanut butter cookies. Right now, we also have some seasonal specials like pumpkin spice and salted caramel. Would you like me to hold some for you, or are you thinking of placing an order? Um, actually, could you hold some of those snickerdoodle cookies? Those sound really good, and uh, my mom loves them. I'm so glad to hear that. I want to make sure I have the right cookie for you. Could you please confirm the name? I'm not familiar with Neckar Dual Cookies, but I'd love to help find the perfect treat your mom will enjoy. Um, sorry, I said snickerdoodle. No worries at all. I'll happily hold some snickerdoodle cookies for you. How many would you like me to set aside, and when do you plan to come by to pick them up? So you can see the AI got a bit tripped up when I... I... I mispronounced Snickerdoodle apparently. And this is just like a demo, like really basic agent to show off the voice anyhow. But that was the 11 Labs voice. Now let's switch over to Cartesia. And once again, I'm gonna choose CMO here. You know, what voices are good on 11 Labs might not be great on um, Cartesia. So let's try this out here. Hi, thanks for calling Tommy's Cookies. This is Emily. How can I help you today? Hi, Emily. I was wondering what sort of cookies you guys had in stock. Hi there, Ed. I'd love to tell you about our cookies. We have classic favorites like chocolate chip, snickerdoodle, peanut butter, and oatmeal raisin. We also offer seasonal specials. Right now, we have pumpkin spice and ginger molasses. Is, is there a particular flavor you're craving, or would you like me to help you put together an order? Could you hold some snickerdoodle cookies for me? I'd be happy to hold some snickerdoodle cookies for you. Could I please get your name and phone number to reserve them? Also, when would you like to pick them up? Yeah, my name is Tommy Christ, uh, C-H-R-Y-S-T. And my phone number is 216-555-1303. And I can pick them up in about um, 30 minutes. Thanks so much, Tommy. Just to confirm, that's Tommy Christ with phone number 216-555. 1303 and you'll be picking up your snickerdoodle cookies in about 30 minutes. How many would you like me to hold for you? A dozen would be great. Perfect, Tommy. I've reserved a dozen snickerdoodle cookies for you to pick up in about 30 minutes. We'll have them fresh and ready when you arrive. Is there anything else I can help you with today? Um, no, that should be it, Emily. Thank you so much. You're very welcome, Tommy. Thanks for choosing Tommy's cookies. We can't wait to see you soon. Have a sweet day. And so there you just heard a brand new Cartesia voice. A couple of things I do want to note, it cracked a bit in there. It wasn't completely perfect. I do think it, when it sounded good, it sounded a lot better than 11 Labs, a lot more responsive, and it seemed to really get tripped up around exclamation points. So maybe that's something you wanna have, something you don't. It did handle the phone number really well. And that's something I used to have to prompt into agents on how to pronounce a phone number. And I noticed it didn't do it there. So I actually wanna go back and see how 11 Labs handles the phone number. And so this is now back on 11 Labs. The Cartesia voice was also noticeably like just a bit quieter and you can actually change the volume of the voices. So that's not a big deal. Just something interesting, I thought. Hi, thanks for calling Tommy's Cookies. This is Emily, how can I help you today? Hi Emily, I'd love to place an order for some Snickerdoodle cookies. Sweet. Can I get your name and phone number first? 
Yep, my name is Tommy Christ, C-H-R-Y-S-T, and my phone number is 216-555-1303. Thanks so much, Tommy. How many snickerdoodle cookies would you like to order today? Um, I'll have a dozen. Got it. One dozen snickerdoodle cookies. When would you like to pick them up? I can pick them up in about 30 minutes. Perfect. We'll have your dozen snickerdoodle cookies ready for pickup in about 30 minutes. Thanks for choosing Tommy's cookies, Tommy. Is there anything else I can help you with today? Yeah. Can you just confirm you have my phone number down correctly? Of course. You gave me 216-555-1303. Is that right? Yep. And um... Great. Your order for one dozen snickerdoodle cookies. Okay, so pronounce the, the phone number correctly. I think it was a bit fast. But you can obviously see, you know, a bigger sample size of 11 labs there. Now, before you make a full-on decision based on, you know, just this little demo here, and again, I do think Cartesia sounds a bit better, I want to note a couple of things. One is that 11 Labs actually offers a couple more customization features for their voices. So if you come here to this little gear, not only do they have like a bunch of uh, models to choose from, but you can adjust the voice speed, the voice temperature, which is basically, you know, how emotional or monotone it is. And that comes with its own downsides and not, and the voice volume. You can adjust all three of those. Now, if I come over and select a Cartesia voice, let's just say it's Adam, I go on Sonic 3, and the voice speed, I cannot adjust. And I can adjust the voice speed as well as the voice volume, but not the voice temperature. And say so I want it a bit louder because it was a bit quiet when I first spoke to it. Let's see how this performs. And um, I'm actually going to switch back to SEMO uh, for this, just to keep things even. Hi, thanks for calling Tommy's Cookies. This is Emily. How can I help you today? Hey, Emily. I was wondering if you have any like specialty cookies for Halloween. Hi there. Yes, we do have some special Halloween themed cookies right now. We're featuring pumpkin spice, candy corn sugar cookies, and spooky chocolate chip with orange frosting. Would you like me to tell you more about any of these or help you place an order? Sorry, I just like talking to the Cartesia voice. It's, you know, being in this industry for like almost over 18 months now, it sounds the best I've ever heard a voice agent so far. Now, jumping back into sort of the nuances of this, one, Eleven Labs has a couple more features you can adjust. Two is that Eleven Labs has a massive voice library that you can choose from. So if I look up Eleven Labs voice library, it actually comes up immediately because I'm in here all the time. You will see they have this huge bank of voices to explore from, all these sort of ways to categorize it and filter them. So you can see tons and tons of customization here. Whereas Cartesia has the same thing, except they have significantly less filters. They have like four different use cases. Gender, there, there's only really three to choose from for either. Accents, and they obviously have, you know, a number of languages. So say English, they have, you know, a bunch of different accents. They have a good variety there. But, you know, there's just less organization here compared to everything that Eleven Labs has. Now, that being said, all things equal, I think a really good voice matters so much for voice agents. And it's really something that can make or break $10,000 project that your company is working on. Or if you're an agency, you know, you're working on these projects all the time, can really make or break a project having a good voice. And so making sure you nail that is worth other downsides such as, you know, less voice selection or not being able to change the temperature. Lastly, I do want to mention that anytime you have a new model like this, it tends to be used a lot and have a, has a huge spike in usage right when it comes out. And they're sort of, you know, testing it and fixing stuff. We saw this with GPT-5, specifically in voice agents. It caused a bunch of latency. I could see the same thing happening with Sonic 3 potentially where its latency gets really high at just sort of this beginning time because a lot of people are testing it out and running a bunch of calls with it. And so I'll actually implement this with some of my clients. I'll report back to you guys. Make sure to check out stuff like my LinkedIn and otherwise, and you can see uh, you know any updates on this. And I'll let you know whether I actually re recommend it for production yet or not. 
But in this closed test environment, I do think this voice sounds fantastic. And so thank you guys so much for watching. If you'd like to work with my agency directly, make sure to click the top link down below. You can book a call with me. And if you want advice from me directly on how to build these or how to actually start your agency, make sure to join my school community down below. It's completely free. So thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.